Come on and get on down to the city, city. where the trains all clatter through. Hey, look at that driver driving. driving. Want to ride that train on blue? Me too. I'm looking way up high to the windy. Take a peek on in that view. All those people busy working. busy working. I want to see what they all do. Come on, let's we round the market. Do you hear that color blue? Everybody's busy selling. I want to buy me something new. Look through the arches under the station, down where the pigeons perch and coo. Take a taxi ride to the river. I want to drive down the avenue. Hey, look at those buses gleaming. They look so clean and spanking new. All lined up to drive around the city. What man ting that bell to the loo? I'm going to ride on right to the school stop where the children hurry through. Sit down, the teacher's teaching. I'd love to learn a thing or two. Me too. I love to skip the river to go Five o'clock. I love to skip Come on and get on down to the city, city. where the ferry boat stands the blue. Have to call on Granny Murray. She'd love to say hello to you. Me too. Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has one at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home to. Who's here today? Well, today we've got Junior, but don't just sit there, my wee rocker. Come on, let's get moving, baby! <laughs> Up on your feet, yoo-hoo! Air guitar, boom, boom! <laughs> Goodbye, yoo-hoo! Up with the guitar! Junior, but someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Bobby. Yes, with Kai. Bobby. Hi, Granny Hello. Murray. <laughs> we have been having a great laugh playing air guitar, haven't we, Junior? Oh, wow. I love playing air guitar. Come on, Kai. Rock on! Oh, go for it, Bobby! <laughs> Why don't you dress Claude up as a pop star? Don't forget his guitar, boys! And we can rock and roll to the chairs, Bobby! Good yeah. idea! <laughs> Do you know what? Sometimes when I'm at work, I pretend to be a pop star. Come on, baby! Yeah, rock on, baby. Yeah, rock on, baby. Woo! Come on, baby. Oh, darling, what a rocker. But what I love most about singing in the depot is because it's so big, you get these brilliant echoes. Echoes, echoes, echoes. <laughs> I love them. Echoes can make ordinary sounds sound spooky. Spooky, spooky. <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Sorry. Sorry. Oh. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> look, I really think I'd better get off to work. <laughs> oh, will you look at Claude? <laughs> oh, Claude, you look cool, man. Jeremiah, <laughs> I want you to play with this when you're at work. Oh, Let's thanks, see. Kai. You ready? Come on, baby. <laughs> Woohoo! We'll see it. Rock on, baby. I'll play this and I will think of you. Oh. Come here, give us a hug. Mm. I'll see you in the morning. <laughs> Come on. Bye. Now remember, echoes can make ordinary sounds sound spooky. Thanks, Granny Murray. I'll see you later. Bye-bye, my darling. We'll be thinking of you. Me too. Well, you keep a wee eye on Bobby and make sure she goes the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today Walking my shoes through the city view Stepping along, I'm swinging my arms I'm singing my way through the city's charms Getting there is just so fine I so enjoy my walk in time I always know the way I go But can you show me the way I go? Hey! Oh, OK, which way? Do 
I go left now or do I go right? Which way is wrong now? Which way is right? <laughs> okay, that way. To the bus depot. I'm on my way to work today. I look in this way and that away. Oh, hello, digger. Hello, drain. Oh, hello, lamp post. Hello, train. Hello, post box. Oh, hello, plane. She's on her way. I go up now, or do I go down? Which way's a smile now? Which way's a frown? Ah! Okay, that way, up the steps. You told me the way I go. Thank you, you showed me the way I know. Okay, I've arrived at work. What's next? Mm-hmm, that's right, I need to change into those work clothes. <laughs> All dressed and ready to go. <laughs> I wonder if I could really play the guitar. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Bobby and the Buses! Woo! Oh, whoop, that makes an echo. What a cool sound. It's a bit like playing guitar and having your very own backing band. Ladies and gentlemen, I give to you Bobby and the Buses with her amazing backing group, Echo! Come on, baby! I said rock on, baby! Hello, Dr. Juno. Having fun? <laughs> Just messing about a bit. How are you? Absolutely exhausted. Oh, you poor thing. I've had such a hard day. I was worried I'd fall asleep peddling my bike. So I thought I'd come and see you and ask for a quick cup of tea to revive me for the journey home. Of course. <laughs> After you. Oh, make yourself comfy and I'll brew you up a nice cup of... Oh, you angel. <laughs> you just relax there. Oh, I could flop here all night. How's Kai? Kai? Oh, he's a star. <laughs> All safe and snug with Granny Murray. <laughs> I love to skip in river sea bingle, river sea bingle, by the sea. I love to skip in river sea bingle, river sea bingle. Would you like to be an echo? Okay, okay. Hello! Hello! <laughs> I'm silly! I'm silly! Woo, Kai! Woo, Kai! Your mummy had an echo at the bus day for two. Mummy! Oh, mummy! I'm thinking of you, mummy. Oh, Kai. <laughs> what on earth is that noise? <laughs> hey, Dr. Juno, can you hear that funny no... <sighs> oh, look! It's Dr. Juno. Oh, she's fallen asleep. And she's snoring. <laughs> um, Dr. Juno? <laughs> Dr. Juno, wakey, wakey. Huh? Oh, what's the emergency? Oh, Bobby. Sorry, I was dreaming. <laughs> you were snoring. I don't snore. Oh, well, if you weren't snoring, you were making a really funny sort of a noise, just like this. <laughs> was I doing that? <laughs> Oh. You were. <laughs> well, that's not snoring exactly. No? No. It was the air I was breathing in causing a vibration of the soft palate of the roof of my mouth, resulting in a hoarse noise. Mm. Vibration, eh? Well, I'd really better get back to work. Oh. Then I'd better go home and get to bed before I fall asleep again. <laughs> oh, thanks for the cup of tea. And the nap. <laughs> <laughs> You're very welcome. Bye. Bye. Right. Time for me to get on with some hard work. Bobby Boogie Woogies as she cleans and mops the bosses. Sponging with a squeegee, sweeping rubbish with her brushes. Shining up the headlamps for the night time show. Bright and beaming buses, bye bye soon. Cleaning while you're dreaming, making ready while you're. Day of 
ready to dazzle the day away. Swing into the city looking pretty and radiant. The hot caps gleam, the paintwork shines. A river sea double decker looks so fine. The driver she drives, collecting the fares. Leaving then arriving, she will get you there. This boss is stopping from picking up and putting down. This boss is shining, it's the talk of the town. Bobby Boogie Woogie slipping over, flipping under Running round and scrubbing up, she really is a wonder Sticking up the posters as she wobbles on her toes Bobby walks the moon walk as she robs and wipes the windows Dusting through the starlight, adding sparkle as she goes Polishing the buses so they'll all be gleaming for the day ahead <sighs> That's that done Bobby! Oh, Mickey John, you made me jump. Sorry. I was uh, just wondering if you'd seen Nurse Hendry. No, I don't think so. Why? Well, he was supposed to be getting the bus to my place for supper and a game of billiards, but uh, he never turned up. Well, I think they were quite busy down the hospital tonight. Maybe he's just got held up. Yeah, that's probably it. Well, I'm sorry to trouble you. Say hi to Kai for me. I will. Bye! <laughs> Mickey John says hi, Kai. Hey, it must be nearly time for you to go to sleep. I love to skip in River Sea Bingle, River Sea Bingle, that's for me. Dance to your daddy, sing to your mummy, dance to your daddy, to your mummy, sing. Thou shall have a fishy on a little dishy, thou shall have a fishy when the boat comes in. My mummy would take this song. Would she, darling? What are you doing now, mummy? What on earth is that noise? Oh, that is spooky. Oh, no, I don't like that noise at all. It's scary. Oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know whether I should run or scream. What could be making a noise like this? Where did the time go? At five o'clock, I took Kai to stay with Granny Murray. We had great fun playing air guitar. I told Granny Murray that when I sing at the depot, there's a brilliant echo, and Kai gave me a toy guitar to bring to work. At six o'clock, I was playing with the toy guitar when I noticed that my singing was echoing around the bus depot. It sounded amazing. Dr Juno was so exhausted cycling home from work that she called in for a cup of tea. At seven o'clock, I heard a funny noise. It was Dr Juno. She'd fallen asleep and she was snoring. At eight o'clock, I'd just finished some hard work when Mickey John called in to ask if I'd seen Nurse Hendry. He'd been supposed to be getting the bus to see him, but he hadn't turned up. At nine o'clock, I was getting on with my work when I heard this really spooky noise. Now I don't know what to do because it's really frightening me. Now remember, echoes can make ordinary sounds sound spooky. Echoes can make ordinary sounds sound spooky. Well, that certainly sounds spooky. But maybe it's just an ordinary noise, like Dr Juno snoring. Yeah. Yeah, that is a snore. Definitely um, an echoey snore. God, somebody must be fast asleep here in the bus depot. I've just got to find out who it is and where they are. It's a race against time. I've got to do it. I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it. I've got to sort it, I've got to do the job on time Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song Do we think she's going to do it? Do the job that needs to be done Will she know how to fix it? Will she finish what she has begun? It's a sure thing I'm kind of she will get there in the end Because she knows what she should do I'm going to do it I'm going to do it I'm going to beat that Nurse Hendry, wakey wakey. What? Is it taking me to eat? Bobby? Am I dreaming? Where am I? You're on a bus. 
asleep and snoring. I never snore. Oh, of course not. I don't. Oh, right. Uh, I suppose it was just a, a result of the air that you were breathing in, you know, um, causing a vibration on the roof of the soft palate of your mouth. Exactly. I work so hard all day and I'm so tired. I must have fallen asleep on my way to Mickey John. Hello. Hello, Mickey John. I've been wondering where you got to. Mystery solved. He was asleep. Oh, you must have been really exhausted to fall asleep on a bus and miss your stop totally. How did you know he was here? He was vibrating. You mean he was snoring? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I'll drive you home. Bye, boy. Thanks, Bobby. Bye. Hey, I wonder if my little boy is snoring. One. Mummy will be here in the morning. I wish I was with you, Mum. Mum's here, my darling. Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> Hello, Mummy. Oh. Have you had a great time? You betcha. I think you should give Granny Murray a big thank you hug, don't you? Thank you. Oh, come here, my treasure! <laughs> and thanks from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. Echoes can make ordinary sounds sound spooky. It saved the day. It never did. <laughs> come on, time to get home. Oh, come on, Kai. Let's go. Looking forward to next time. Me too. Right. Come on, Twinkle. Let's talk about our time away. <laughs> And I suppose you'll want to know all about my time too. Well, there was laying, running, creeping, jumping, chasing, painting, laughing, baking, bathing, dressing, singing, swinging, walking, sliding, hunting, hiding, jumping up and turning round, dressing up and sitting down. But what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as a pop star because we were having a great time listening to music and playing air guitar. Claude looked really cool. Bobby and I had a good laugh talking about echoes and Kai gave Bobby a toy guitar to take to work. Later on, Kai and I played an echo game and then at bedtime, I sang Kai a lullaby. He really loved that. When I went to check on Kai later, he was snoring softly and sleeping peacefully. And when Bobby came to pick him up in the morning, she told me that she had remembered what I said about echoes making ordinary noises sound spooky and it had saved the day. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye-bye, honey pie.